As temperatures climb, a Facebook post is sparking debate on what to do if you see a dog by itself in a hot car. Yeah, Gaston County woman shared these pictures on Facebook over the weekend. You can see a dog left in a car with the windows cracked. The temperatures at the time were in the mid 90s. NBC Charlotte's Brandon Goldner in Gaston County tonight. Brandon, a lot of people commenting on the post saying they would have smashed the car's windows, but is that even legal? For any animal lover, seeing a dog panting inside a hot car may tempt them to take action. But law enforcement says to slow down before you start smashing in. Sunday afternoon, a friend sent Bobby Pardon a photo of this dog, which she says was stuck in a hot car. Windows cracked open while she says its owner was inside shopping at the Gastonia Walmart off East Franklin. With temperatures Sunday just under 95 degrees, the temperature inside a car can reach 114 degrees just in 10 minutes, 129 degrees in 30 minutes. This is not a new problem, so it's, it's really frustrating and hard to understand why it still happens. Pardon says her friend called 911 before sending her this photo, which she posted to Facebook as a public service announcement. Many people commented saying her friend should have smashed in the window. But like leaving a dog in a hot car, smashing someone's window to save a dog in North Carolina is illegal. Both Gaston County Animal Care and Enforcement and Parton, who has 20 years of pet boarding experience, say the best option is to call authorities who are allowed to smash windows. According to Michigan State University's Animal Legal and Historical Center, South Carolina has no specific laws about helping an animal left in a hot car, though Pardon says it's simply better to let first responders do the smashing. But it's just so much safer to leave them at home. You don't want to run the risk of brain damage or a heat stroke. And we'll post a graphic showing how the temperature outside correlates with the temperature inside a hot vehicle online at WCNC.com. Brandon Goldner, NBC Charlotte.